You're just one decision away from a new life. You make a new decision listening to what I'm talking about tonight. And when you wake up tomorrow, you'll be at a different level of vibration and you'll see a different world. People ask me, how does this change work occur? It occurs by the fact that this is a nugget of wisdom that will blow your mind. So keep, put your seatbelt on and get ready for this one. That your eyes aren't cameras. Your eyes are not cameras. That you're not seeing a world out there and processing it in here. People th think they see things. They think they see my wizard cup of tea. That I've got a wizard cup of tea out there. And I see it through my eyes. And I process it. And I decide that's a cup of tea that tastes very nice. For me. No, it doesn't work like that. You ready for this? My eyes are projectors. That I'm putting that cup of tea out there. That I have a certain capacity in my mind, like that's a 128 gigabyte mini iPad. I'm on a 250 iPad Air at the moment, but that's my mini iPad. And that has a capacity. And when it's full, I either have to upload it to the cloud or I have to increase the memory. Put a memory card in or put it into storage somewhere. You know how that works when you've got so many things on your, on your mobile phone and you want to download something, it says your memory's full. So you have to take something off to put something on. Now your mind is the biggest computer in the world. But there's far more stuff than is in the world. You've got a universe and you've got a multiverse and you've got eternity and you've got unlimited potentiality and you can't keep it in here. So what we do is we project it out there and that's the world that we see. That the world that we see comes from you and me. The world we see comes from you and me. We put it out there because we can't deal with it in here. So we have inner visualizations and inner tutors called your intuition, your inner tuition. But you've also got outer tuition by connecting to other dimensional beings, God, if you like, divinity, angels, whatever words you want to use, I'm happy with that. And what actually happens is we can Bluetooth and blend and entrain and connect to that and get stuff that we can't hold in our brain. We entrain and connect to stuff that we can't hold in our brain. So it comes, it doesn't stay there, and it goes. This is why when you get these inspirational flashes, these light bulb moments, what I call super conscious, miraculous connections, you need to write it down, because you'll forget, because you won't store it here. When I've done a tarot reading, it's gone. When I've done a psychic or a mediumship connection, I say it and it's gone. I can't, don't ask me what I've said, because it hasn't come from me, and it isn't stored in me. It's come through me. I say it on behalf of the universe and then it's gone. And you can do the same. Nothing special about me. Not bigging myself up at all. You've got this power and ability. I'll be teaching psychic skills, connection, entrainment, Bluetooth into the universe and other, other, ident uh, other dimensional beings. I've already done some lucid dreaming training, some dream work, some breath work. I put some breath work on today. Have you done it? Why not?